That's pretty funny you say that, being a footballer. I reckon, um, and you see a lot of footballers when they've got to face someone bowling with a hard cricket ball, they jump out of the way they, and they go, oh, how do you do that? But then you get out in the game of footy and someone's running past and it's going to elbow in the, in the throat or the face or someone punches you from behind or you've got to sit on, you've got to run back or sit under the ball. So to me, there's, there's all different types of courage. Um, yeah, I, I really, res what I respect with, um, if I had to respect someone, there'd be the two opening batsmen, Darling and Wood. It's 1978, it's January, late January, early February. It's in the West Indies and those two kids, both 21 years of age, go out without a helmet on to face Croft, Garner and Roberts. Unreal. Now to me, that is as good a courage as you can find. But then, Robbo, you've been out here where some of the tough blokes of footy, Lee Matthews has probably tried to run across and break your knee or elbowing you in the head. So there's all different types of courages, isn't there? And you're talking to a bloke just at the moment who didn't have too much courage.